Hello guys, this is Dr. Kuro Fix today. I want to teach you guys how to update the firmware of your D8BT or D8. This is pretty much very simple. Now, you're not going to be needing to plug it to your car. There is no need, right? There is no need. So, the first thing you want to do is to go ahead and power up your car device by depressing the button down here. And uh, if you come into the menu like this, it's not a problem. You just go ahead and click this. And allow the system to initialize after booting up. Let's wait for it for a while. Okay, so updating the software is pretty much simple. And I go from here, as you can see right now, we're showing that, that there is 57 updates. So either you do it from here, then choose individually from each of the car brand that you want to update as you can see here Renault immobilizer update available so there are different different kinds of uh updates firmware update that's going to be available within the first two three years of your usage depend on the what they actually say they're going to do that is going to be free before you start paying for it and uh What is the second way to update uh, the firmware of the system, which is going to be somehow personalized? Is go back from here, click here, then go through the system diagnostics here. Okay. Now, as you can see, there are red, red button there on the Europe. There are 17. Asia, there are eight. America, there are five. China, there are 16. Australia, there is one. So you want to go ahead, uh, let's take a look at this, swipe, I forgot to tell you, you have to connect it to your Wi-Fi from here to be able to update, alright, you have to swipe it to connect to your Wi-Fi through this guy here, then uh, as soon as it connects, it's going to show right up here, so you can see right now it has not connected, it has connected right now, you can see before you can now go ahead so you can update this directly from here by touching the red arrow let me go to the vw and update it touch the red arrow to take you from here now as it's showing blue it means it's ready you go ahead and click it and it will start downloading the update the latest update for your for the available firmware of the system and let's say that uh, the update is not yet available then it's going to be looking like this and showing pdf so if you click on the logo it will take you to ford car system uh, interface but if you click on the red button there arrow pointing up then it will take you into the update uh, interface so you can be able to update it so that is why because this is not ford and uh, I have the DC, uh, VCI disconnected, so let's cancel it. So that's it, guys. That's how to update it. So let's say Toyota, you can go to Asia and you see the Nissan, Nissan GTR, Luxan, uh, Proton. Those are the ones that are the Mitsubishi that are having their updates already. Infinity, that their update is ready for installation. Let's go to America. You see Buick, Cadillac. Uh, GMC, Saturn, Lincoln have updates already. So, China, Wanshun, or Shunshin, Shanfeng, Wenlong, Shunshan, Shunshin, you see Jack, Jumbo, Tulong, MG, Li Fang. Southeast, South Park, Arizona. So Australia holding. So guys, typically that's much. That's a how to update the system firmware of the X to the eight. I hope you find this very quick tutorial very interesting. If you do, subscribe to my channel for more. If you have any other video request you want to make concerning the D eight, go ahead and drop the comments in the comment section and I'm gonna do it because this is my own piece for now uh, 
for the next coming year and year and year and year until when I get tired of it or I find a better option to buy then I can decide either to sell this one off and buy that one or whichever so guys see you later power off yes